Hey guys, it's Miss Stenmeyer. First off, I just want to say that I love you all and I miss you. And I'm so sad that we're not together right now. But I know that you guys are safe and at home. And so I'm glad about that. And I know that we'll be together again sometime soon. Okay, so you guys just got your packets this week. The new ones. And so we're going to be learning some new things in science. So what we're going to be learning about is plants. So we haven't really talked about that in class yet. So I wanted to talk to you guys a little bit about plants and we're gonna do some fun, cool things while you guys are at home through our videos, okay? So before we start, we need to learn a little bit more about plants. So I'm gonna teach you guys some things that you don't know about plants and then we're gonna do something cool. Okay, so I want you guys to look at that first sentence and see if you can read to your mom or your dad, whoever showed you this video, what that first sentence says. Remember, a sentence starts with a capital letter and ends with a period. So just look at that first sentence, not anything down here. Just look at that first sentence and see if you can read what it says. Okay, do you have it? So it says, all living things need blank, and it starts with an S, and something that starts with a W to survive. So what are some things that all living things need to survive? So these things up here under these blanks, these are things that you should already know that we've talked about. All living things that we, something we all need to survive. So what could it be? What starts with an S that all living things need to survive? Let's see, see if you can guess it. Okay, the second letter is a U. It, what does that say? That says sunlight. All living things need sunlight. Okay, what else do all living things need to survive? That starts with a W. Let's think what that could be. We talked a lot about this in class right before we left. We did a lot of things in science about this thing that starts with a W that all living things need to survive. Let's see if you remember. What does that say? Water. So we already know that all living things need a sunlight and water to survive. Okay? So there's some other things, though, that plants need. So I have here all the things that plants need to survive. So we're going to try to figure out what they are. So this first one, it starts with the W. What did we already know? What did we already find out? That all living things need to survive and plants are living things. So what do they need that starts with a W? Water. Okay, so we already know that. We knew that one is water. What about this other one that starts with an S? What's another thing that all living things need to survive that plants need too? Because they're living. Sunlight. I bet you guys got that one. Okay, this next one we haven't talked about with all living things, but we have talked about it in class before. So I have a hint for you that it's an earth material. What is one of our four earth materials that starts with an S? Let's see, it can't be rocks. We already have water. What's an earth material that starts with an S? It's not sand, but soil. So plants don't just need the soil they specifically need the min the minerals in the soil so the soil has minerals that's going to help the plant get what it needs it's kind of like food for the plant it needs those minerals so soil is one of our main things okay we also have an a what could a plant need it's a living thing that starts with an a humans actually need this too can you think what we need to survive what a plant might need to survive Starts with an A. What's that word? I, I R says er, an A. So it's air. Air. Plants need air. All right. And this last one starts with an S. We haven't talked about this in science much. We might have talked about this sometime during our grow time. Talk about personal space. Okay, so plants need water, sunlight, soil, or the minerals in the soil, air, and space to survive. 
So now that we learned what plants need to survive, we are gonna grow our own plant. So does anybody know how plants start out? How do you grow a plant? What does it start out as? Anybody know? It starts with an S. It's seed. So I have some seeds in here and we are gonna plant our own plant. So there are things that we need for a plant to survive. Let's see, let's look at what we needed. So we had water, sunlight, soil, air, and space. So let's see if I have all of those things. So we have some water, we have soil, and there's some air in here, there's some space, and I'm gonna put it right here on the windowsill so that it can get some sunlight. So first we have to put some soil in our cup. I'm gonna use this to grow our plant, okay? So we're gonna put some soil in there. I'm gonna take a spoon. You might not wanna use your mom's spoons if you're doing this at home. Let's see. We put some soil in there so that our plant can use all of its minerals. Okay, we'll put some soil. Now let you guys see. We've got our soil in here. Okay, so what has to go in there next? We have to plant our seeds. So I'm gonna open this up and let you guys look at the seed. So here we have our seeds. Okay, you see they're tea tiny. Okay. So these plants, you see how small it is compared to my finger? Okay, these are super, super tiny seeds and they're gonna grow into a plant. Okay, so we're gonna take our seeds and put them down in our soil. So we have our seeds down in the soil. So I'm gonna push them down in there Make sure they got in there all good. Okay, and I'm gonna take some leftover soil and put that on the top of it. So it's not right on top, so it's got some soil over it and some soil under it for the roots to grow. Okay. So now we have our soil down at the bottom, then we have our seeds, and then we have some more soil on top of it. Okay, so it has some room to grow. So we have our soil, we have our seeds and the soil. We have space, we have air. I'm gonna put it right by the window for sunlight when we're done, but what else does it need? What's the something we're missing? Water, okay? So I'm gonna put just a little bit, I'm not gonna put too much, just so that it can soak down in there and get to the seeds. Okay, so now our seeds have everything they need except for sunlight. So if I just leave it right here, it's not gonna get much sunlight. So I'm gonna put it by the window. Okay, so now I have our plant by the window so that it can get some of this sunlight out there. So our plant, can get the sunlight and grow, okay? So what I want you guys to do at home is I want you to get a piece of paper and I want you to draw a picture of what our plant looks like now. Okay, so we just have our soil, we just planted it, our seeds are down in there, but I want you to draw a picture of what it looks like and I want you to write a sentence about what we did today to plant our seed and for it to grow. And then we're gonna keep watching it and keep looking at it and watch how it grows over time. Okay guys, that's all for today. So I want you to go ahead and draw a picture of what our plant looks like and write a little sentence. You can write that on just on a piece of paper and put it in with your packet. And then just wait for more videos to see what else happens with our plant. And if you guys want to, you might talk to your parents about doing this at home. You could just get some soil and seeds and that's all you need. You have water at your house and you have sun and air and space, so you could do that at home, or if not, you can just watch the videos of me showing you my plant. Okay, but I really enjoyed talking to you guys today. Look forward to seeing you soon. Bye.